Good morning, everybody. Welcome to Honeysuckle Farms. My name is Todd. All week long, the only thing I could think about was getting back up to the farm and finally getting the trusses installed and the roof dried in. Little did I know that this weekend, everything would go wrong. And just to add insult to injury, another hurricane, that's right, hurricane number two, is headed straight for the farm. It's a very special weekend this weekend. If you haven't followed the channel, uh, we got our trusses in this week, we got our sheeting, and we got our bracing. We got our top plates up, we got our walls straight, and we're fixing to put these trusses up today. Now, <laughs> as uh, luck would have it, we've had about three or four weeks of dry weather and today we're supposed to get some rain. But, uh, you know, we're gonna work on through it. Uh, we got a lull in here today to help set up the trusses. That's a little too tall to be trying to manhandle trusses and uh, I'm not sure who we've got coming in. I know, I think Matt and Terry are coming. It's just gonna be the three of us and we're gonna try to get these things up today. So, you know, it is what it is, but uh, we're happy about it. And um, I can't wait to get this thing dried in. I wish, wish we could have been on schedule. We would have had it dried in before, but uh, wanted to take this time to thank all of you who subscribe and watch our channel. We would love to hear from you, so please like, comment, and share our videos so we can keep it going. We're a small channel and every little bit helps. Thanks again. All right, so we got our layout done. Uh, we've got some trusses ready to get, get flown up. Uh, we're gonna start setting them in place before we do any nailing. So um, we're just getting these things up here. It's uh, supposed to be in the 80s today. Hopefully the rain holds off and uh, we can get this done. So we're gonna get at it.
Today is Sunday. We call it Carriage House Day. Um, we were a actually working on the carriage house yesterday, putting the trusses up or attempting to put the trusses up and Mother Nature decided that she didn't want us to do that. So <laughs> I think we got rained on like five times yesterday. We were only able to get eight trusses up and which means we have 17 more to go and we've got all the sheeting to do and uh meantime there's a storm coming or a hurricane i think coming this way so by the end of the week it's supposed to be raining again so you fight the weather you fight the you know you just fight a lot of things and uh but you know all you can do is just just get it done you know so hopefully my help shows up today. <laughs> I wasn't the happiest person yesterday, to, t to say the least. But, uh, you know, hopefully they'll show up today. And we've got a little system going. We finally, you know, it's a, it's a little pr issue going on with these recessed gable ends. And it's kind of hard to explain, but I'm not a carpenter. It's a better thing that we have the recessed gabled ends so when we do the over framing the overhang it's it's a more sturdier product but being that it's recessed you can't it's it's it, we can't run our braces across it so anyway make a long story short uh once the rest of these trusses are all what are called commons at two foot on center we should be able to set those up pretty quickly and uh, hopefully get some sheeting on this thing and get it dried in today. It's going to be a long day, but, you know, as I always say, we're, we're going to get at it. So, we think we got a plan here today. Uh, thank goodness Matt and Terry showed up this morning. We've got rain coming, bad weather, blah, blah, blah. But uh, we're going to get this thing done. Um, we kind of, like I said, I sat up here last night after everybody left and kind of thought about it and figured out what we could do to make this go faster um like i said we're not carpenters and definitely uh it's a learn as you go thing so i think we've got a system set up and we're gonna get at it Alrighty, well, we our system got working well, and we were knocking them out, and now it's raining again. But as you can see, we've only got five trusses left. It's looking good. So hopefully this rain will just be about enough for a break time, and we can get back at it. All right, so we give a little update now. We got all the trusses up. And then the bottom fell out. We started putting the bracing up. And then the bottom fell out. We had lunch. Went back to work. And the bottom fell out. There you go. We got all the trusses up. Now we're putting our bracing on. And hopefully within the next hour or two, we're going to start sheeting. Um, we've got a big storm coming in. Supposedly to this area here and by the end of the next week so i don't know i'm gonna push it as far as i can and see if i can get this thing uh get it sheeted and get it dried in i'm just flat tired of water and mother nature has not been kind while we've been building this place so 
It is what it is, and we're fixing to get back at it. Well, it's Sunday afternoon after about being rained on five or six times a day and getting as far as we could. We finally had to shut down. Um, we got all our trusses on. We got some of our bracing on, but we got some of our soffit board on too. Ultimate goal is to get this done and we're going to get there no matter what we have to deal with. So with the help of my wife and some friends, we're going to make this happen. It's Monday. Um, turned out we had a pretty rough weekend. Uh, it was a very big, big weekend for us. We got the trusses in last week and we were we got some uh, people that were going to come out and we were going to get the trusses set and you know, uh, everything just didn't work out. Um, Mother Nature decided to, she needed to uh, drop some rain around here and it rained and it rained and it rained. Needless to say, we probably got about half of the amount of work that we wanted to get done because we spent most of the time dodging the rain. Unfortunately, and you know, we even worked in the rain for quite a while. And by the end of the both days, Saturday and Sunday, we were just soaking wet. And we, we you know, we just did all we could do. But uh, we got the trusses up. We're working on this soffit. And uh, we were trying to get things set up so we could start sheeting. But like I said, it kept raining. So they're going to pick the lift up today. So I have time this morning where I'm going to try to get some work done up on this front overhang. Like I always say, and I know I say it quite often, it's no problems, only solutions. You just got to deal with it. Um, it's the way it is in life. It's the way it is in, in everything, work and everything. If you, if you want to get by, you want to succeed, or you want to, you know, just, just hang in there like we do, you got to, you know, so just got to deal with it. So that's what we're going to do today. Um, now, you don't know. <laughs> uh, there's nobody else here. My help's gone. So I'm going to be, have to be climbing up on this pallet that we have set on the lull <clears throat> to get up and hang these pieces. And the only person that's going to be able to drive it, that's here to drive it, is my wife. <laughs> and she's never driven a piece of equipment. So, uh, yeah, am I taking my life in my hands? Yeah, I, I, could, I could possibly die today. <laughs> but we're going to do what we can do to get this done. Uh, I'm waiting for her to get up here in a little bit, but uh, I got some work to do before she gets up, so I'm going to get at it. Alrighty then, well, I uh, stayed here Monday morning hoping we could get some time on the lift before they came and picked it up, but you know, they come and pick that thing up pretty doggone early. But I was able to get our front overhang soffit boards up. And uh, that's about all I can do without the lift all i've got to do is nail two boards up 
my rafter ends up on that top on that front that'll take care of that and that would have been in two sides that would have been real nice to get done you know i always try to look at the the good of everything so half of the soffit would have been better than not but you know we got what we got done uh i was six and a half to deal with the the wife driving picking me up in the the lift so i don't know maybe it's a better thing <laughs> <laughs> I'm still alive <laughs> so well again hope you guys had a great weekend hope you have a fantastic week uh, we're gonna do what we always do we'll be back here next weekend getting at it doing the best we can and uh, you know we'll just take it from there so just remember don't you ever ever give up on your dreams my name is Todd this is Honeysuckle Farms hope to see you next video